Welcome back, JC here. In the last video, I showed you how to power your SP Racing Evo flight controller, uh, depending on what types of ESCs you were using. But like I said in that video, that is not going to place voltage in your in beta flight, clean flight, on-screen display, telemetry, nothing. So if we plug in a LiPo battery, we are getting power to the flight controller. And if we plug in a USB, then go into beta flight, we will see up here it's showing nothing. And the reason for this is because we are powering the flight controller with 5 volts, whether it be from a 5 volt regulator from a PDB like this, or linear ESCs, which also produce 5 volts. So for it to know what the voltage of your battery is, it has to see the full voltage of the battery. This is why they add in VBAT pins. And if you look on this flight controller, if I hold it this way, you will see a plus sign, V, and minus sign. This is the VBAT pins. So we need to solder in some wires in between the positive and negative on the VBAT pins and your uh, PDB. Okay, so soldering the wires on will look something like this. Make sure you have positive on the right pin and uh, ground on the other pin. If you get these mixed up, you will fry the flight controller. Now, these wires need to go to your PDB, and it can go anywhere on your PDB where it's getting the full voltage of the battery. This means that you can place them right on top of your battery leads, like I've done here. And uh, you can also place them on the ESC main power and ground pads. Uh, basically, you want to place this anywhere except for a voltage regulator. So, uh, for example, I have a 5 volt and 12 volt regulator here. You would not want to use those because you would only see 5 or 12 volts in beta flight, on screen displays, telemetry, everything else. So, now if I plug in my LiPo battery, it's sending the full voltage of this battery to the flight controller, which this does not power. Like without the 5 volt regulator, like I talked about in the last video, this alone will not power your flight controller. It is only letting the flight controller know what the voltage of your battery is. So if we plug in a LiPo, or <laughs> LiPo, our USB cable now, and go back into beta flight, we now see what the full voltage of my battery is. Now this could be off by a little bit. You want to take a multimeter and check the voltage of your battery. Uh, I do have a video showing you how to calibrate your voltage should it be slightly off. Just uh, I'll leave links to my Evo uh, playlist and, as well as the Betaflight playlist. Look in the Betaflight playlist for the video on how to calibrate voltage. And that does it for this one guys. Thanks for watching. I will see you around.